Hi Aquarius, getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on for you. We're going to start with the oracles to see the messages coming through. All right, what is going on for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sea, seahorse, so this is about being confident, being assertive, phoenix rising, manifesting, unexpected, ooh, be open. Okay, something could be coming towards you, something that you've been manifesting, it may, when I see the be open card, it may mean that it comes in in a way that you weren't expecting. Okay, so be confident because you're manifesting something that you want, and it may be a surprise when it happens. What are you manifesting? Let's see, what is this? What is this energy that's coming in toward Aquarius? Ace of Cups. Definitely could be love or something that you love, love to do. Let's see. Fool. Yep. Brand new beginning. What else? Nine of Coins. Could be a lot of money. Could be a job. Could be a lot of different things. But all right. So it's all good. Good news. Something is manifesting that you have been waiting for. All right. What is going on for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Someone is heartbroken. It's funny because these cards feel very stuck together. Like they don't want to talk. And this may be, um, so this may not, this may be you, how you're feeling right now. Maybe you're upset because something hasn't worked out up until now. But you got the Phoenix rising in this deck as well. So a new phase, rekindle, renew, transformation, growth. So something definitely is going to take the place of you being heartbroken. Some of you may have been spending a lot of time healing recently. Okay, we're going to do your person for this reading. It may come out differently. We'll see. And again, this could be something platonic. It does not have to be, you know, a love relationship. I mean, they're all like, quote, love relationships, but it may be platonic in nature. What is the overall energy? Five of Cups. Hmm. What's on someone's mind, your person's mind, is the world. How they feel about you, the Four of Coins. They may be hiding their feelings. How you come across to them, how they view you, six of cups, and potential outcome right now, five of coins. But see, that's okay, because this can change. That's why I say right now. So you got some fives here. You got some changes going on. Under the deck is the two of cups. So I'm going to go back through here really quick and clarify each one. So someone is sad, like another five, but they want to change that. They want to fix that. There's a new beginning. They may want to travel or come see you. Leave the past in the past. How they feel about you, the four of coins. They've been holding on to something. I got the word eternal. So I'm not sure if that's like eternal love or something. But what is this six of cups? This is how they view you, the past. Nine of cups. They have good memories of the two of you. Maybe a cancer month of June is coming through here. And then what is the outcome of the five of coins? Why is this the outcome? messages okay six of coins could take like five weeks then maybe what they're saying because five could be the timeline but again it can mean changes i feel like there is a sudden movement forward in this reading like there's something closes there's a door i get that closes it could be like a metaphor not necessarily a door but something is changing here very suddenly and it does say that though it says like unexpected so there's something that's coming back to life or something changes that you've been manifesting or someone's manifesting you back. But there's messages here. Show us what this Eight of Wands is. Someone, I'm getting someone a contract or a career. Something is coming back to life in one of those areas as well for someone. Uh, again, this could be somebody coming back like an ex or someone from your past who you've been wanting to talk to. Might be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius or Pisces as well. We also have Cancer here, but Eight of Wands. Something that was in like hermit mode that's coming back to life. So it could be a Virgo and Six of Swords. It almost feels like a block is being lifted. I'll be honest with the way the readings come across. This reading is coming across. It's like it goes from dark to light immediately. Like there's like you've probably been waiting for a long time. So it doesn't mean it happens overnight. You have been waiting, but it's like there is a sudden shift. You know, sometimes when you're a phoenix rising, like let's say you start something like, like losing weight or a business, it takes a while to get off the ground. It could take months, you know. I think this is more sudden. Someone could be receiving some money. What is the six of coins? I'm sorry, four of coins. I'm seeing the four of coins. I feel like the six of coins with the six of wands. What is this over here? Ace of wands, an idea. See the five of coins. See what I'm saying? It's like something suddenly happens. 
and good news messages the star card yeah five of wands the queen of pentacles the temperance card there could have been another person involved uh, could be an earth sign taurus virgo capricorn as someone who maybe was holding things up this could also be someone who's making a decision i mean this could be like a judge a lawyer as well uh, something like that or an ex a lot of times queen of coins is an ex occasionally she can be like a mother mother-in-law figure but not always for me but um fighting over property could be a divorce is settled someone just may wake up one day and just feel like that okay it's it this is the turning point i'm going to turn a corner i feel better today something along that line as well we have taurus here sagittarius aquarius wow yeah see what i'm saying there's a major ending here showing up in your reading which is really really good look what's under the deck so now i have like two of these together the world and the death card that tells me there is a major ending you know the divorce is final the papers are handed to you um there is something that is like totally done ending could be someone is buried actually i don't want to be morbid but i mean it's like something is like finalized when you have this and the tower under here not wanting to see the tower manifesting the past making a decision to tower something it's like someone's finally making a decision okay let me go to different decks i feel like i'm kind of just going in a circle here and like i'm not getting new information let me let me get a different deck and see if this one's going to talk different okay they're telling me to go a different one okay. what is going on for aquarius sun moon rising and venus some of you almost like someone also is out of prison like it is they're done their sentence is done this could be a metaphor for a bad relationship as well but there's something here where like you're receiving the documents or someone else is and they're coming towards you you're going to partake in the you know what's coming after which is like the good news so page of swords in reverse the king of cups eight of swords not moving ahead with the seven of swords queen of coins is in this deck as well but she's in reverse making a decision not to not worry See, this looks like a relationship or a family issue when I have people showing up like this, especially the King of Cups, because this is usually not like a judge or a lawyer or someone helping you. This is someone who's either emotional or water sign. But Page of Swords is like, I feel like this person's not communicating or talking. Sometimes Page of Swords in reverse tells me someone who's not spying anymore. They're not taking that action. But this feels like someone who's keeping their mouth shut and they, maybe they shouldn't be. Hmm. this is somebody who somebody who's causing problems kind of what i'm getting here who wasn't doing the right thing who was keeping people um in the dark what is this unexpected card over here what's coming in temperance someone is losing patience five of swords putting their sword down working together page of wands in reverse not communicating something or not the ace of coin but see what i'm saying someone is it's unexpected someone is not going to fight anymore the five of swords is in reverse and they're willing to work together there's something here where like they're giving up and they're giving in maybe there is some good news coming from a water sign for some of you Something, I don't know, it, I don't know exactly the details of what's going on, but someone is basically, it's like the end of the road, the end of the game. Something is changing and it's going to benefit you. And it doesn't have to be your love life, Aquarius. It could be, you know, money or it could be you get to move now or something like that. But it's definitely, I get good news coming in. I mean, you can see right here phoenix rising heartbroken to like a new beginning manifesting a new change and i think how it happens may be unexpected it may not really affect you but maybe someone decides to stop arguing and to put in the effort or to work together um, something like that maybe a new judge is appointed to the case or someone gets a different lawyer something like that but whatever this is maybe someone changes their opinion or how they re treat you or something like that so just just know that something is changing in your world i know this is, to me this doesn't really feel like a love reading but that's okay it's what needed to come through things are changing for you you are a phoenix rising so just be ready to go from like heartbreak to happiness all right so i'm gonna leave it there you guys have a really good week